G'day. Today in episode 460 of Trend 365, we take a look at the concept of umbrella branding. Okay, so this is maybe the last of the lessons that we're going to learn from the great Weight Watchers branding debacle. Might be the last, I might think of something else tomorrow. But it's the idea of creating an umbrella brand. Now, if you're familiar with what Google did a few years ago when they created Alphabet, it's kind of the same thing. Basically, Google was a super well-known brand, but it was known specifically in the field of search. Then they started to go off and enter other businesses, other areas they wanted to get into, but those businesses didn't necessarily fit the brand of Google, the brand of searching. And so what they decided to do was essentially created a new parent company called Alphabet that would sit up top above Google and then the Google brand was free to go off and continue doing their search business, which is what they're known for. And Alphabet in the same way can then feed off the leverage off the brand equity of Google, which is obviously well established. At the same time, Alphabet is now free to go off and do whatever they want. To me, that's what Weight Watchers should have done. If they really wanted to go and become a digital wellness company and launch this trust mark called WW, what they should have done in my mind is left Weight Watchers the hell alone because that was an established well-known brand in a very specific field that was related to the overarching mission of WW, which was to improve wellness. And so they could have created WW as a, an umbrella brand, Weight Watchers stays as it is, and WW is free to go off and do whatever the hell they want to do. That would have been what I would have suggested had I been asked. Nobody asked me. Um, don't know whether you know anything about umbrella brands, but if you're thinking about expanding into uh, associated businesses or industries that maybe don't quite fit with your current brand, think about umbrella brands. Alrighty, that's it for today. Thanks for tuning in. I will be back again tomorrow. See ya. Oh.